Hey guys, um, this is the Psycho Surgeon here to review the Human Centipede 2 full sequence. Like scary movies. Uh huh. <laughs> full sequence. Um, I, I also reviewed this film back in December along with um, the Human Centipede first sequence, um, but I just rewatched this film so I thought I'd re-review it, you know. Um, this is basically about um, a disturbed loner called Martin who um, he basically is obsessed with the Human Centipede first sequence, you know, the first film. Um, He's obsessed with it. He even he watches it like thousands of times. You know, he watches it over and over in his office. You know, because he's a security guard in a um, parking lot, I think, and you know, some something like that, a parking attendant, something like that, and. Um, <laughs> He basically just watches this film over and over on his laptop in his office. He's really obsessed with it. Um, he even holds a scrapbook with plans for his own centipede. That's why he um, watches the film over and over to learn from it. And so he can um, make his own centipede. In this film, it's a l actually more extreme because there is a 12-person centipede. Well, actually two people die so it's a ten person centipede um... this is a great good film in my opinion in this film we have um... lawrence r harvey as martin um, ashlyn yenny as herself and then we have the centipeders of course um, well actually ashlyn yenny in this film also is a centipede he somehow gets her flown over to London, flown over to England, to Heathrow Airport. He picks her up and basically knocks her out with the crowbar and ends up um, getting her, ends up, and she ends up the lead, you know, the lead centipede, you know, she's the lead, she's the first person on this human centipede of his. Um, this is a hundred percent medically inaccurate inaccurate because martin Martin in this film no surgeon at all he has a pet pet centipede in this film he actually ends up killing his his own mother when um she finds his human centipede scrapbook and basically yeah with a cr he ends up bashing her face in with the um crowbar. He just knock his sedative in this film is the crowbar. He just knocks out all these people with with a crowbar. Every single person who comes to this parking garage ends up being knocked out knocked out and kidnapped by Martin, pretty much. Um I know this is a huge spoiler for for you guys that haven't seen the film, but he this was actually all in Martin's head. For you people who um have seen the film, you do know that because the beginning is the ending. And um yeah. I didn't really find the unrated director's cut nastier because sure there was that rape scene but that didn't really bother me much and also the the uh, you know masturbation scene of Martin I with the sandpaper in his office you know that was a little bit extended but that's about it not really much difference between that and the um on demand version that was 
you know that's you know that's still around the um v video on demand version you know the censored version I actually prefer the censored version to the unrated director's cut because the censored version i has hasn't got that rape scene. I feel the rape scene is a bit is a bit pointless in this film. So yeah, that's pretty much all I got to say. I recommend this if you're a fan of these sick twisted type films because this film really raises the bar. I mean, it's gory, it's gross, it's disturbing, it's shocking. I had all those feelings when I saw this film for the first time. So, yeah, so that's pretty much all I gotta say on the Human Centipede 2 full sequence. Thanks for watching, thanks for listening, subscribe, peace.